Hey, I'm Hart and I love fashion. And because of fashion, I've been all around the world. I've attended Fashion Week, I've worked with different brands, I've been to New York, Paris, Milan. I've met so many people and I have met a lot of your style icons, a lot of my style icons. It's pretty amazing. I love a lot of different people actually all at the same time. I love seeing anyone that actually expresses their personality when it comes to their fashion. So I'm not so much into a lot of trends. I like just basically expressing myself with my accessories, with my shoes, with the colors. I started getting into fashion maybe five years ago, but that was like being really serious about it when I started to attend Fashion Week. But I believe, I think I started my love for fashion ever since I was a little girl because my mom and my dad were pretty much very into dressing up and really loving fashion. I think I am a mix of different things. I do love classics. I love muted colors. I love monochromatic looks. But at the same time, I also do love splashing my bag with paint. I love funky shoes. I love, you know, fixing my hair differently. I do love piercing my earrings. I've started to get tattoos. So it's just really a mix of different things and it really depends what my mood is. It really depends on where I'm going, how I'm feeling, and if I'm saving money or if I can buy something else. A lot of people ask me how I choose my outfits or how does Kat Cruz, my stylist, help me with choosing my outfits. We do collaborate a lot, but at the end of the day, she really allows me to just express myself with whatever I want to wear. Does my husband choose my outfit? No, but this one helps me a lot. That's right. Shy lang ako, but mom's right. Say hi, Pan. Hi, it's me again, Panda. May TF ba ako dito, mom? This is Panda. A lot of you know her story already. She has her own vlog. She also has her own IG account, Panda Ong Pauko Escudero. Mom, say it na please. I have so much to do pa. Yes, I know. I'm about to say it. I actually owe a lot of my best looks to her because she helps me a lot. She doesn't really speak English. She also doesn't speak Filipino. Means in the French, sha, but I don't understand French. I don't know if it's strange. I don't know if it's odd or if I'm imagining, but I really believe that every time I'm about to leave the house, she has this certain look to let me know if what I'm wearing is nice or not. Pan, look at this. Is this nice? Um, okay lang. Hoy, bagong bili ko to. Sabi mo ako maganda ba? Hindi. Kiss mo nga ako. Ah, may grandpa na nga lang around the house. Hindi daw maganda. So I don't know if you're a fur parent or not and you can relate to this, but it's pretty clear what she's trying to tell me. So my biggest fashion critic is actually from here, Quezon City. Dito siya. Panda. Hi guys, it's me again. Did you miss me? I miss being in the vlogs, TBH. Okay, so I know why she's tough on me actually because Panda's really a fashionista. She really is, truly. She's so particular with her color. Oh my god. You know, na kailang palit na kami. We had the Tiffany's, we had the Guyard. You know, I get it, but. It's just so funny because she really knows what she wants and that's why I kind of believe her. She really truly is my daughter. Yeah, you can call me crazy all you want, but I'm sure the fur moms are gonna back me up right there. She's really my daughter. So if you follow her on Instagram, Panda is known to be very maldita. And you know she is. She has bitten about, she's gonna be good 15 people na. But not like, her. You know when you say, I didn't bite with my teeth, I just, good lang, good lang, like that, good on chat. I mean, I get it, I understand. You know, she also had a troubled past. OMG, mom, can you not? Okay, I'm sorry, I won't talk about the troubled past. So, yun na yun, ayun na pag usapan yun. But really, at the end of the day, I must say that she is such a sweetheart. She's always there for me, not just when it comes to my fashion, but the unconditional love. It's unbelievable how someone can love you so, so much. And I think a dog is the only thing that can love you like this in your whole entire life. That's why it's so important that she takes care of you. And you know dogs are animals 
will love you till the day they die but it's also important that we actually love them back and really take care of them and not just by giving them leftovers or scrap from your food no it's actually making an effort to give them healthy food bringing into the vet making sure that their skin is healthy or being attuned to their feelings if is there anything wrong with your dog or your pet now speaking about taking care of their health like there are a lot of unknown diseases that your pets may have that you don't know i've had a lot of nightmare situations where i have lost a pet like if you remember casper he actually passed we took care of him but we didn't know that there was something that he had that we didn't know about and it was called Arlikia. Arlikia is actually like the dengue version of dogs or cats and it really kills the dogs and you can actually help them and they can survive with just taking medicine for seven days you know stuff like that so you really need to make sure that you know your dog very well and you take care of them another thing that panda and i love using is this Simparica trio it's actually really good for heartworm it can be for five types of ticks which can also include for the Erlikia is also probably good I have all of these always and I'm so so lucky that I was actually aware of all of things that you need to do because my dad used to really teach us how to take care of our dogs and he would always tell us that the number one problem also aside from Erlikia is heartworms knowing that my other pets are safe especially panda she goes around with me so she goes to like different gardens she meets other dogs she goes to parties it's very very important that she's protected from all of these diseases and at the same time it protects the other dogs from getting any kind of virus or any kind of illness and it also protects humans like us even if you kiss a human being you'll get a disease of somewhat now but it's the same with dogs and with your pets so it's important that you actually go to your vet and you ask them about this type of medicine because this is something that will definitely save your pet's life so remember when you go to the vet you have to check first if your dog is healthy usually a blood test would be able to show you if she has any parasites in the blood or if there's anything wrong if your dog has cloudy eyes or a lot of like dirt around the eyes you have to definitely make sure to check them for ringworm because that's one sign so these are the things that aren't really known to a lot of fur parents out there so you have to get them checked and they'll usually give you prescription and this is something that you can purchase for them this is Simparica trio so you really have to ask your vet because as you can see it's different for each dog it's not for all kinds so this is from 5 to 10 kilograms this is from 10 to 20 kilograms you also have 20 to 40 kilograms and then there's 2.5 to 5 kilograms panda does not fall here <laughs> pan yes mom do you fall here yeah Grab it, man, mom. diet. So I love my pets, and I do plan to live with them till what? Panda, hundred years old. Tayo, de ba? Sabay tayo. Yeah, mom. We've talked about this a thousand times. You and me forever. So I plan to live with her, and she plans to live with me. So we have to make sure that they are always healthy. That got a little emotional, a little bit serious, but please do enjoy my toughest critic over here when it comes to fashion panda rating my outfits finally my time to shine mom like what mom said i always have a say in her outfits watch me rate some of her outfits from the past don't worry i'll be nice may change outfits din ako wait lang kayo 10 over 10. Love this red Carolina Herrera number. Plus points for mom because boo is buhay photo in New York for content. Mmm, 8 over 10. Cute naman, pero I feel like it's an 8. Do you also miss mom's bangs? 1000 over 10. Give ko talaga sayo here, mom. You looked so stunning that night. Hmm. 7 over 10, kas mas maganda fur mo sa akin dyan, mom. Cannot be. Oh. MG, rare photo of mom in streetwear and sneakers? 10 over 10, but also because I'm in the photo, of course. Bonsoir, mom. This pearl studded dress from Jean Paul Gaultier is everything. 10 over 10, 6 over 10. Because you want to know a secret? Mom doesn't do groceries. Why can I put some carrots? Kaloka? 10 over 10 because this is how you do twinning. I'm pretty sure her look was 100% inspired by me. I mean, 
Look at that color palette. I'm giving this 9 over 10 because I remember I told her to change her shoes, but she didn't listen to me. Hi, Nokomam. But this is giving me VJ heart vibes. Cute! I always hear mom say she loves Uyana, and I have to agree. She always looks good in her pieces. I love how this shows off her waist and that neckline. Obsessed! 10 over 10. Like my mom, I'm a Chanel girl too. Also, that's my purse around her neck. Pinahiram ko lang. 9 over 10. That's it, you guys. What do you think? Should I do more videos here on YouTube? Comment down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe.